Check out this video just released by the American Civil Liberties Union of Oregon. It's supposed to show what life is like on Portland streets. It's also tied to a petition demanding city officials, among other things, stop sweeping homeless camps and scale back their arrests of homeless people. That petition has more than 4,000 signatures. KGW's Maggie Vespa joins us. And Maggie, today advocates hand delivered that petition. Yeah, Kathy, they did. Reps from several agencies, including the ACLU and Street Roots, came to this morning's city council meeting and took the mic for several minutes. At the core of their plea and their petition, that the city use more compassion, they say, when dealing with Portland's homeless population. Specifically, they want a moratorium on police sweeping camps. They want the city to cut back on the number of police officers and put that money toward affordable no housing. And they want to reduce homeless arrests. This after a report by our news partners at the Oregonian showed just over half of all arrests made by Portland police last year involved homeless people. At today's meeting, advocates and homeless people alike talked about how hard it is for people to get off the streets. There's a lot of sleep, uh, sleep deprivation out there, which can be uh, thought of as mental illness, but it's not. When you're not getting enough sleep, your health goes bad, and you also make wrong decisions, which other people think that there's something wrong with you. Once again, here is that video produced by Fifth Column Films, and we have reached out to Police Union President Daryl Turner about these demands, but we haven't heard back. It is worth noting that when that Oregonian study surfaced, Turner slammed the mayor for calling for an internal investigation, and he also called Portland a, quote, cesspool. Now, today, for his part, Mayor Wheeler said police are now put in a, quote, nearly impossible situation and that they do not arrest, he noted, or cite people for being homeless. But he also added that when it comes to issues of public safety, they do have an obligation around criminality.